Hi, my name is Scott Young, uh, ex Cardiff City player, um, now Community Foundation Manager at Cardiff City. Here we today at the House of Sports to uh, watch the futsal scholars prepare for the match tomorrow in Birmingham. So, should we go and take a look at Ashley's session? Right, guys, let's go! In, in the past, we, we've let ourselves down on not finishing chances on. Um, and going forward, we've kind of slowed the game down instead of actually putting them on the back foot. So, today's session is all about counter attacking, can we get on the back foot? playing through the, what we call the blind side, which is where they haven't got their numbers. So hopefully we're going to put in that to practice tomorrow, and hopefully when this goes out Saturday, we would have, we would have got three points. When we intercepted their plays, we were too slow counter-attacking against them. We need to get ourselves in a position where we can slide the ball there, because with his first touch, he's in on goal, and hopefully this guy will get around the back. You're going to pull back, don't jump over it, pull back, shift to the side and stop, that's one. Back to the start, shift to the side, two, three. Cristiano Ronaldo does this as a warm-up. Our philosophy, how we play futsal, is constantly trying to face people up and beat them 1v1. Our last option would be the pass. If we can beat down man, that's great for us because we're creating overload. If we can release the play and we rotate and start again. The intensity of it is unbelievable, you know, and clearly they're all technically very good. So it's not much different to obviously a full 11 v 11 game physically there's different aspects but touch beating a player the skill of it you know it's all very good one last week good result we were sloppy but we grind the result out tomorrow it doesn't happen okay we start fresh we start bright we get our goals we get a win and we go away happy the birmingham futsal arena plays host to the north south and central midlands divisions this week saw Port Vale thrash crew 8-2. Wolves number seven put in a man of the match performance as they beat Mansfield. Hereford made light work of Peterborough winning 11-2. And Jason Lee's Nottingham Forest were beaten 5-4 by Leicester City. The Cheltenham lads were showcasing some skills and they managed to beat Bristol Rovers 4-3. Cardiff City faced West Brom and found themselves behind early on. But after a quick chat from the manager, the boys were soon level. And they scored their winner with a nice counter-attacking goal to ensure all three points went to Cardiff. Well done. I am thoroughly deserved that. Well done. Well done. Aye, superb. The win leaves Cardiff top of the South Midlands division. Yeah.